Hello guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. Today, in this tutorial, we will make a simple four sensor miring circuit, or simply you can say that an FSR or four sensing resistor circuit with the help of Arduino within the Tinkercad. Usually it works on the principle of applying the pressure on the sensor and when you will apply the pressure on the sensor then the resistance will vary as according to the uh, applied pressure. Like when there isn't any sort of pressure then the resistance is very high <coughs> between the terminals of the sensor and when you just uh, lift your uh, finger it becomes very very high and when you put your finger it becomes very very low uh, okay and resistance is obviously uh, in the units of ohms so okay we will first fetch our Arduino and now we have then we used to write force and we got our force sensor. You can see that this sensor consists upon two parts. Uh, the below one is the pinouts and the above one is a circular sensor or circular part of the sensor in which you can see some sort of metallic lines. Usually these type of sensors works on the principle of piezoelectric effect and it is the same principle which is usually applied in your touch screens or TFT touch displays and like these so okay now no polarity for the sensor so we can connect any of the pins with any of the what's called is any of the pins with any of the power like ground or VCC so we have connected the terminal 1 with the 5 volt now we will take one resistor of 1k and now it is connected with the second terminal of the sensor now we will attach the other side of the resistor with the ground so now this is a pull down resistor for us because it helps us to connect to the ground. So okay now up from, from this terminal 2 just take one wire and connect it with the analog 0 pin of the Arduino Uno. Okay now this is our simple circuit. Okay now we will come towards code and I have written a code already that is uh, in which uh, we will measure the force that is applied on the sensor and the sensor will will convert this force applied to a appropriate electrical signal that is then fit it to the analog zero pin so here now we have declared some sort of parameters, some sort of variables and we have three categories like if we don't apply any sort of pressure on the sensor then, then there must be written no pressure and if there is some, some bit pressure we can say it is uh, a light pressure then if the value is going to increase some bit then it is medium and if our force crosses certain threshold then we can say that it is high pressure so okay now, now we will simulate it out we will see on serial monitor that it is it is showing us no force at all no pressure okay now we will increase some bit now it is showing us a light pressure now we will increase a bit still it is showing light pressure now we increase a bit 
now we are in the range of medium pressure at 0.779 sorry 0.77 newtons now we are going to increase and now it is a high pressure now all above high pressure some medium then again low light pressure and then no pressure at all so hopefully now you can uh, write you, uh, all this code at your own as the code is very small so you can directly uh, copy it from from the from this screen just write it and also analyze the code so hopefully you got the concept thanks for watching